Good morning. Welcome to the WCCE Morning News Show. My name is Eduardo. I will be your anchor for today, Wednesday, November 11, 2020. This is week four for activity classes. Here's Jose with the weather. The current temperature in Lake Wiley, South Carolina is 72 degrees. Today's high is 77 degrees. The low tonight is 69 degrees. The forecast for today is rain with a chance of thunderstorm. Now back to our anchor. Thank you. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I salute to the flag of South Carolina and pledge to the power of the state, love, loyalty, and faith. I chronically pledge to seek smart solutions, be on board with learning, act responsibly, and respect others. And now for a moment of silence. Today for lunch, we will have a hamburger steak and gravy or cheesy chef salad. Dr. Dickey, Ms. Hamilton, and Ms. Taz would like to wish a happy birthday to Paxton Higginbotham, Liliana J, and Emma Zaro. Please see your teacher for a birthday pencil. Don't forget to shop at our online book fair. Here's another preview video. This is Nubby, a special boxer born with no front legs. A family decided to rescue him. All I could think is, how the heck are we going to do this? They woke up every hour through the night to help him grow strong. Where are you going? At first, it seemed impossible that Nabi would ever walk. But his family is refusing to give up on him. There really is nothing he can't do. And he's making so many new friends along the way. He doesn't give up. I mean, he could, but that's not what Nubby does. It doesn't matter how many legs he has, where he's at, he's just happy. Look for Nubby's story at your Scholastic Book Fair. Hi, I'm Ashley Franklin, and I'm the author of Not Quite Snow White. I wrote Not Quite Snow White because I wanted a book that showed the type of princess that I wanted to be when I was younger. I wanted a princess that could be anybody or anything she wanted to be, no matter what she looked like. Tamika is a bold, fun-loving girl who loves the theater. She can sing, she can act, and she can dance. She is very confident. So when the opportunity comes for her to play her favorite role, that of a princess, naturally she takes it. Tamika tries out for the role of Princess Snow White, but the other students aren't too sure that she's just quite right for the role. Is something wrong? asked her mom. The other kids said I'm too tall, too chubby, and too brown. I'm not right for Snow White, said Tamika. You've got it all wrong, mom said. Besides, said her dad, you're just enough of all the right stuff. You can be anything you want to be. You have the ability to reach for your dreams, and it's okay if you're scared along the way. Look for my book, Not Quite Snow White, at your Scholastic Book Fair. Good morning, boys and girls, and happy Veterans Day. Today, we salute all of our men and women in uniform for the contributions that they have made for our country. We want to extend a huge thank you to Ms. Ketchum, Ms. Tyler, and Mr. Moser for putting together a special virtual Veterans Day tribute. Teachers, you'll receive an email with a link to view it this morning. Please select either the 8 o'clock or the 1 o'clock viewing time as it best meets your schedule. Again, boys and girls, our veterans have made so many sacrifices for us, so today we salute each and every one of them. Also, boys and girls, today is the first day for our Giving Tree Ornament Selections. This year, your, we have some wonderful volunteers who will be coming to your classrooms. Teachers, please have the green Giving Tree forms ready when the volunteer arrives at your classroom. If you'll just give them the stack of return forms, they will call each student out one by one to select their ornaments. 
Thank you again, and if you have any questions, don't hesitate to let me know. Continue to soar and make it a great day. That's all the news for today. Thank you for watching the WCCE Morning News Show. Have a great day.